Oh, that's a big one. Oh, bloody good. Oh, yeah, that's more like it. Nice. Very nice carrot. Hello everyone and welcome to another video. Today we're doing something a bit different. I've got a fly rod on board and I've got some real light stuff. Four kilo line and under only today. We've had two cyclones roll through in the last two weeks so I'm pretty keen to get back out on the water. All right, let's get going out onto the spot and I'll see you out past the channel. going on here we'll head out to about 15 or so I'm keen to just get a bait down and maybe the fly if a few fish turn up into the little chunk trail I'm gonna make so we've got a couple of little bait casters here they each have four kilo braid on them and we've got a couple of little ledger rigs on them just with really light leader about 30 pound couple of small circle hooks and I'm going to put a bit of pilch little bullet turner in them then I'm going to do a little chunk trail this chunk trail will bring in a few fish the reason why I put the backbone into the trail is because there's actually quite a bit of ammonia in the bone that seeps into the water and whenever I throw out backbone pieces it just brings fish in way quicker than just throwing chunks out and often it'll bring in the larger snapper so that will be part of the bullet turner going over so I think what we'll try is bullet tuna first. Who's bait caster down? There you go, first couple of baits. like on this tiny little rig <laughs> this feels like using a toothpick compared to my other rods got a fish on the screen quite high I've already had a couple of whacks at it just had another whack again I'm just going to let it down nice and slowly there we go Ah, the mackerel. Here's the first interesting fish for the day. Nice big mackerel. Pull up your fins for me, buddy. There you go. GoPro take a photo. Hooked up. This side of the boat seems to be the ticket. Man, I can't imagine what's going to happen when I hook something really good. I'm going to get annihilated. Hopefully it happens, it'll be entertaining. Nice little kahawai. Look at them. Man, 
Man, we're just catching some really nice kingfish baits. Oh, some snapper in the trail. It's a little better. A few snapper starting to turn up. They're almost illegal fish. Don't take them to this size anymore though. Oh, we've got a carrot. Did you look at that? Carrot in the trail now. That's a keeper. Oh, oh, nice. Carrot in the trail. Nice. Very nice carrot. Not an enormous one, but pretty good size for a start. They're crazy looking fish, aren't they? Not a few bigger ones, not these little ones. Just find where the hook is. Bit of weight there. Possibly another journey. Yeah. Another nice journey. Alright. I don't lift them at that weight. That's another dinner fish though. Nice just in, in my range. Well, this spot's died off pretty significantly. We're really only getting small fish anyway. We've got a couple of nice scooters in the back. Couldn't really get anything to stick on the fly or the little soft plastics. So we'll probably just stick at it with the baits. And move out to 13 or so meters maybe. Just have a look at what this wind's gonna do because it just dropped off. But it was, um, it was just going to be a bit of a pain to come back into earlier. We've headed out to 13 metres now. Water colour has not really changed much at all. That's barely a metre still. I wouldn't even say this changed at all. No change. Here's the bottom. Boy, out. Now let's get set up.
Let's put it down to where I was seeing them. Straight onto it. How big is this one? These big, big Mackies, those are. Oh, that's a big one. Really big one. Man, if only I had, had gurned this big on the bottom. That's a big Mackie, look at the size of him. And a bit of chaos here. Fish all over the screen. I've got lines wrapped around each other. Not sure what I've got here. Felt like I hooked a snapper. And oh yeah, we do. All bloody good. Oh yeah, that's more like it. He's gone around my other line. We've finally got a nice one. Couldn't get the camera to turn on. That's a lovely fish, that one. Lovely, lovely fish. There we go. Finally, something worth holding up to the camera. Well, I thought that was another mackerel, but we've got another gurnard. About time. Let's get this anchor up.
got a few fish on the real light stuff. Nothing really massive, but we got a good feed once again. Snapper good, it as per usual. I think next time we'll head out and have another go at the pinkfish. Just got to pick the weather gap, because it's a long way out there. I'll just show you what we've got here. There's the zip. We're going to go straight onto the ice. Well that's going to do it for today's video, it was an enjoyable one in the end, not too strenuous thankfully. Go home and do the filleting and get those fish in the freezer pretty quickly. Hope to all see you in the next video, thanks for watching guys.